Good morning. I know I look like kind of a hot mess right now, but I'm just kind of getting things in order for today. Um, it's October 2nd, which means yesterday I like paid all the bills and everything. So today I'm kind of just balancing out, um, not really the checkbook, but um, my, where my accounts stand right now. So that gives me some peace of mind. And um, yeah, then in, in a little bit I'm going to get started on my work for today. So here's the reading I need to do today. I need to get through the last couple chapters of this and then the last part of this. And then I'm done with both of these. It's about 3.15 now and I'm going to head over to campus to sign some paperwork for my job and then probably do some reading, more reading, because I haven't finished all my reading, and um, meet with a girl, well, hopefully both the girls in my project group for a presentation we have to do. Um, then I have class, it's from 7 to about 9.30, so yeah, this is one of my late nights. Tomorrow is my other late night and that's pretty much it for this semester. Um, it's been an adjustment uh, to night classes for me. I'm not used to staying up late to work, but, um, well actually, no I am, because I used to be in city council meetings from like 7 to 10 on Tuesdays anyway, so I guess it's not that different, but um, yeah, it's been a little bit of an adjustment, but it's been going pretty well. I'm, I'm adjusted at this point. Hi everyone, so I don't know if you can see me. Hopefully you can, but it's about 9.30. I just got done with class and I'm going to head home. So I'm probably gonna end the video here because I'm probably just gonna go home, do, guess what, more reading, and then go to sleep. So, good night. So yesterday was kind of a bust. It's now October 4th. I didn't film anything yesterday because yesterday was really um, stressful and I had a lot of work to do, so it just did not happen. But today I'm going to get started with grading, first and foremost, because I have a lot of that to do. And um, then at 4 I have class, and then I'm done with classes for the week. And then hopefully Nathan is coming over tonight, um, and we can, it's also National Taco Day. So maybe we'll go out for tacos. I'm totally failing at this today. <laughs> Um, it's now almost 3 o'clock, so I'm going to head to campus for my class, um, and it's finally cooling down here. Like, it's been raining, raining, because <laughs> it's Southern California, um, off and on for the last couple days. So now it's like, ooh, fall weather, fall weather, high 70s, low 80s. That's our fall weather. But that's how it is up north, too, where I'm from, so. Yes. Um, yeah, but I'm excited because it means, especially for like night classes or late afternoon classes that get out when the sun is starting to go down, I can wear fall clothes. <laughs> also, I took a glimpse at the writing, se whew, writing center schedule for tomorrow morning, which is my first day there, and five out of six of my appointment slots are booked. <laughs> so I'm going to hit the ground running. I thought maybe... Fridays and Saturdays wouldn't be so busy, but apparently Friday mornings are a hot time to go seek writing tutoring. So, yeah, I was like looking at what people were filling out for what they needed help with, and it's it's things I'm, I'm pretty sure I can help them with, so that's, that's good. It's all English class students tomorrow, so that's nice. But yeah, I'm going to try to get there early, well, I'm going to get there early because just to like get acclimated and stuff. So, yes, I was very surprised, though, to see five out of six of my appointment slots booked up. So I was like, eh. 
This is probably my favorite class to read for because it's a literature seminar and we are reading 100 Years of Solitude right now. I'm not sure that I totally understand what's going on, but it's interesting, so let's go discuss. <laughs> Alright, it's 7 o'clock. It's already pitch black outside. 7.30. And um, Nathan is on his way over here. And it's National Taco Day. So I'm pretty sure we're going to get tacos. And I'm very excited about it. <laughs> You'll remember this time last year I didn't go out for tacos, but I made tacos at home. And it's just funny how fast a year goes by between taco days. I don't know what I'm saying. 